Okay, I'm gonna offer you guys a challenge. I've got 3,000 trees planted. Some of them are in pots, some of them are in the ground. I'm a little bit ahead of you, I guess. I got a head start, but it ain't too late. These things are tiny. Well, they only have like an inch of growth or less. So anyway, I have one season ahead of you, but it ain't gonna matter too much with this challenge. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna challenge you to plant 1,000 trees. Okay, so if you can't do 1,000, let's just do 100 if you can do 100 or even 20. Let's just say you plant 1,000 trees. And in 10 years, you harvest them. They're worth 200 bucks a piece in 10 years. Let's give it the benefit of the doubt at 10 years. So in 10 years, we got 200 grand worth of trees because you're gonna sell them for 200 bucks a piece. So that's $200,000. That's $20,000. If you divide that by the 10 years, you take the 200,000 and you divide it by the 10 years that it took, that pays you $20,000 a year for your efforts. And then you take the $20,000 per year and you divide it up into 12 months that's $1,666.67 that you earned if you go back from the day you started planting the trees to the day that you're selling them. Then you have earned $1,600 a month for your efforts to, to plant the trees. So in my estimation, it's a really good investment. I think that we ought to all work together on it. Let's see if we can get a million trees in the ground. I'd like to see in the comments uh, what people want to do because this, is, uh, this isn't something I normally do. I mostly stick with masonry, but it doesn't hurt to add another stream of income to your, to your plan. And also, it does good things for the earth and for everybody on it. So, I think this is worth our time. I think it's a good plan. Let's just do this and work together with them. Show whatever you can do. And uh, talk about it in the comments. What you can actually plant. What you're able to financially. Everybody's got different finances. So let's see what we can do. Even if you can only do 20 of them. You can put them in pots and plant them in your backyard. This area right here. 10 going this way. 10 going that way. So that's 100 trees in that area right there. I'll measure that and show you exactly how many feet that is so that you can decide how many trees you can fit in your backyard. We're right to nine foot three. So I'd say in a 10 foot area, a 10 by 10 area, you could fit a hundred trees. This challenge will work in a pretty small area. So if, if we can get enough people to do this challenge, where we got enough people doing it to where we can influence a million trees in the ground, I think it'd be pretty cool. You just can't go wrong planting trees, so I think it's a good plan. 10 pots going each direction in two gallon pots will do 100 trees in a 10 by 10 area. Most people would have enough space to do this. So I'll challenge the ones that do have enough space, that want to do it, that have the money to buy at least 20 trees. And let's see what happens in five years. We'll water them every other day and take care of them. And I'll give progress reports as we go along. Part of the reason for doing this tree planting challenge is this guy came up to me the other day and he said, what are you doing for your country? And I sat there for a minute trying to think of what I was doing for my country. You know, I never served in the military, never did anything like that. So I just figured, you know, how to do something. I sat there kind of stumbling around trying to answer his question. I couldn't really answer it. Felt kind of stupid. <laughs> so anyway, I decided that this is a way that we could help with do something for the country. Is you could put trees in the ground 
they make oxygen they they bless everybody on the whole planet so so basically if we can get the you might think well how did how does that work cuz they would plant them anyway cuz you buy them you bought them from somebody they were they were already planted so how are you doing anything well the thing that happens is if you buy them they'll plant more to sell more so we bought 3000 trees all together Okay, the idea here is if I can influence a thousand people to plant a thousand trees, that's a million trees in the ground. And if I can influence 10,000 people to plant a hundred trees, that's a million trees that we can together get in the ground. If I can influence 50,000 people to plant 20 trees, that'll be a million trees. So hopefully this will inspire you to put some more trees in the ground and we can all work together to better our world. If you cultivate around your trees real good, then your wife will think you're a good husbandman. This one's the happiest one out of all of them. It's grown about four inches. They're blue spruces. They've got about an inch of growth in one year. They're doing pretty healthy. A full grown blue spruce can produce as much oxygen in one season as it takes 10 people to breathe in in one year. So it'll produce enough oxygen for 10 people to survive for a whole year. One full grown tree will. There needs to be a constant replenishing of the trees in order to keep everybody with an ample supply of oxygen. The more oxygen there is in the air, the better people can like older people can breathe a lot better if there's way more oxygen. So, there's a lot of reasons this is a this is a good plan to go after this. So join me in this quest to get one million trees in the ground. I think it'll be helpful to every person that is alive. Every animal that is alive. And I suppose bugs breathe too, so even bugs, you like bugs.